Hey, what's up, my YouTube friends? How you guys doing? No video intro, no video outro. Uh, just want to do a straight vlog. So, anyways, I got the update this morning. Well, I got a notification of a system update for the G Stylo. I wanted to talk to you guys about it really quick. I know other people like uh, Key Funny or Kia Funny um, commented that they got the uh, system update notification as well. It was like a 419 megabyte file. But because I was rooted, I went and did a full unroot. And when I did a full unroot and rebooted my phone, the system notification uh, update was gone. Which means that every time I go into settings, system updates, and I click update firmware or check um, LG software update, it keeps telling me that it's up to date. Which means that the update that was supposed to be applied to my phone, uh, I won't get, and I've been cycled to the bottom of the list where I have to wait for them to you know, send out the next wave of updates. Sucks. Um, for those who want to know how, like if you've debloated your phone with system files, I'm not sure if, um, if the system update is going to fail because you're missing system files so I will let you guys know if I'm able to apply it to my device I did unroot my device and I will tell you guys how to do it basically uh, if you want to do a full unroot of your phone go into uh, of course go into your device go to super su so when you get to uh, when you open up super su basically you're gonna tap settings and you're gonna scroll through the through settings all the way down um, into the section that says cleanup. I don't know if you guys can see that. And you'll see this option right there. Uh, yeah, right there. Full unroot. You click that and it will fully unroot your device. Once it's done unrooting your device, just reboot and your device is fully unrooted. Um, now, if you were smart, which I should have been, which every app that I had <laughs> deleted out of system, um, uh, the, you know the, the, the system root tree if I had saved those to my SD card I, I you know I would have re-put them back in where they belonged and then unrooted and then it would have been purely 100% stock but because I didn't do that like a bonehead that I am sometimes um, I am missing certain system files nothing that nothing that, that that damaged my phone but I'm not too sure if I'm gonna be able to apply this update even though I did a full unroot so I'm going to wait until I get that notification again to the system update. I'm going to try and apply it. And if it goes through, I'll let you guys know what it's about. If I can't get it through, then I won't be able to. However, if someone had already applied the update, you know, if they got the update today, I uh, would really appreciate if you comment in the comment section of this video what the update was for and if it made, what, what changes it made. Uh, let all of us know. We would all really appreciate that. So... Uh, but until then, I mean, if I can if I can get it updated, I'll let you guys know if no one actually says anything. Uh, different note: I was watching a video from What Would Josh Do? Shout out to Josh and his daughter. You know, awesome dude. I love his videos. Um, so, anyways, you know, I'm kind of disgusted by how some people act. Okay, uh, you know, he posted up a video. Um, you know, he was talking about wanting to get his daughter a new TV because you know, she accidentally broke her TV. And, uh, you know, everyone goes through hard times or whatever. So, you know, any anyone out there is going to try and make ends meet. I mean, you know, what I do here on YouTube, I love to do. It's fun. And you know what? Like I've told people, honestly, I do make a little change. I don't, I don't make a lot, but I do make some. And that goes to my daughters that they get to have extra stuff. Um, you know, just trying to make ends meet, paying all these bills, and just trying to live just like any other person out there. So anyways, in his video, he pretty much goes out to, um, I guess, he's accepting uh, crowd uh, donations uh, to help his daughter get a new TV. And some people are saying some, you know, really uh, hurtful things on the comment section. And, and for me, like, I'm not saying that, that people uh, should accept what he's doing. Uh, everyone's entitled to their own opinion. You, you may be okay with it, or you may disagree with it. But here's the thing. If you disagree with what he's doing, really, do you really have to go and flame his, his comment section of, of that video? 
and tell him something pretty nasty and, and even mention, you know, his kid, like, that is totally messed up. You know, and, and if you are someone that can take the time to comment something that ugly, you need help. You really need help. You need... Yeah, you just... Drink, you need drink bleach. That's what you need to do. Um, to say hurtful things like that, you know, whatever. I mean, I'm not, like I said, you don't have to agree with what he's doing. But you don't have to take time to elaborate an entire comment to just completely try to hurt someone's feelings. Like, that is disgusting and ugly. Um, and, and people have done it to me before. And, I, you know, I really don't, don't, don't play into it because I know it's just trolling and all they want to do is just get a rise out of me. So it's like, whatever, say what you want to say and move the hell on. But, you know, to to say something about his daughter is really screwed up. You need Jesus or whatever God you pray to. So anyway, that's it for my video, guys. Sorry if it got a little, um, you know, towards the end. But, you know, I hate when people do that. So anyways, uh, I am going to stop my vlog and I'm going to upload it. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. My name's Tito and I'm signing out.